Caddy. Caddy. Short for Cadborosaurus. Caddy, with a D, is a resident of Cadborough Bay near Victoria on Vancouver Island, where its likeness may be seen. The name Cadborosaurus, which combines Cadborough for Cadborough Bay and Saurus as in dinosaur, was coined by journalist Richard L. Pocock. Richard L. Pocock of the Victoria Daily Colonist newspaper. Although Caddy is usually associated with journalist Archie Wills of the Victoria Daily Times. A June 15, 1950, Maclean's magazine article by Ray Gardner, there's a link to it in the description, added the regal title King of the Coast. At the time of Gardner's article, Caddy had been seen by 500 witnesses who had estimated its length from between 35 to 110 feet. Gardner also described Caddy's head as being like that of a camel. Among the witnesses was novelist Hubert Evans, 1892-1986, who saw Caddy in the Strait of Georgia off Roberts Creek in 1932. Evans, who saw the beast in profile, described its head as very much like a horse's in general shape, with eye bumps, nostrils, and something in the way of ears or horns. Another witness of the incident thought the creature had a mane on the back of its neck. In 1937, the remains of an unknown maritime creature, supposedly an infant Cadborosaurus, was found in the stomach of a sperm whale at Naden Harbor Whaling Station. The unknown was over 10 feet long, with a head like a large dog, with features of a horse and the turned-down nose of a camel. A sample of the carcass was sent to the B.C. Provincial Museum where director Francis Kermode identified it as the remains of a fetal baleen whale. According to Wikipedia, Caddy has been identified as a plesiosaur, conger eel, humpback whale, elephant seal, sea lion, ribbon or oar fish, basking shark, pipefish, and, of course, of course, a sturgeon. One intriguing idea is that Caddy is a prehistoric snake-like whale called a zooglodon. A zooglodon. Z-E-U-G-L-O-D-O-N. And to translate for American listeners, Z E U G L O D O N, a zooglodon, a zooglodon or Basiliosaurus. Basiliosaurus, a predatory sea creature which roamed the seas during the late Eocene period, some 41.3 to 33.9 million years ago. The Basiliosaurus was a marine mammal in spite of being labeled a saurus, saurus, which means lizard, as in dinosaurs. They ranged in size from 49 to 66 feet in length. And what do I think Caddy is? Dunno. But do I think Caddy really exists? I do. When I visited Cadborough Bay back in the 90s, Dr. Curious rode on its back, and I have a link to a picture of the caddy she rode in the description. What follows is a bad poem about Caddy the Cadborosaurus by the bad poet Warren S. James. Here's to Caddy, raise a toast. Caddy is king of the coast. His home is in Cadborough Bay. Bug him 
and he'll swim away. But Caddy is just too darn long, unless the witnesses are wrong. So, let's hear a rousing chorus. Three cheers for Cadborosaurus. So, are you guys going to cheer with me? You're going to have to, otherwise this is going to sound really lame. Hip, hip, hooray. Okay, let's go all together now. Hip, hip, hooray. Hip, hip, hooray. Hip, hip, hooray. Yeah, that was still pretty lame, but better than me alone. If this is your first visit to my channel, please consider subscribing. My name is Warren, and I write and tell original ghost stories and original horror stories featuring such cryptids as the Night Floaters, Werewolves, and the Black Eyed Children. So again, please consider subscribing. Please help me to reach my goal of 2,500 subs in 2022. Till midnight. Cheers! Music used in today's video was Sneaky Snitch. That earworm, earworm, sneaky snitch by that patron of the internet, Kevin McLeod. <laughs>